As you know, in Windows and Linux operating systems, we can get lines which we have entered in the command line by using up and down keys in keyboard. For example, we run the last command and by pressing up key, we can get it from history. But unfortunately, when we run Oracle on Linux and use the Squirrel Plus and Armin executables, we cannot get previously entered lines by pressing up and down keys. For example, let's run some commas in a Squirrel Plus and try to get the history. Now, let's press up key, and as you see, it's impossible. In order to get history, we should use IDLRAP package. Download it and put it in temp directory, install it and use it when you run commands in SQL Plus or RMAN. Let's install it and show it how it works. So let's change directory to TMP and check the package. Now let's unzip it. Change the directory to newly created directory and use configure to build a new make file. After this, we will use make command to build the program. Now let's run make command. Now make install. Our installation has finished. Now let's check it. RL wrap square plus no up. Let's connect to our database. So state from dual. Select name from video data file. And let's press up key. And as you see, we can get all lines from the history. You can add an alias into a bash rc file to simplify the usage of this package. Let's do it. Home Oracle bash rc. We've added this line here alias rl SQL plus rl wrap SQL plus no log. Now let's use it. This will start a SQL plus executable with RL wrap package. Select sysdate from dual or select name from a dual control file. Now let's press up key and as you see, we can toggle between the comments. That's all.